The city will not take over the old Northridge Mall, at least not now. Milwaukee leaders want to tear it down for a new development. Fox 6's Ashley Sears joins us live with more on why the judge says that can't happen, at least not yet. Stephanie, he's waiting on a court of appeals ruling. Black Spruce, which owns this property here, is appealing a demolition order. Currently, a potential buyer is paying to keep this property safe with fences, cameras, and 24-7 security. It's a blighted property that's caused years of troubles, from break-ins to fires. The old Northridge Mall remains the center of a dispute. The city stands ready and willing to raise the property. Friday morning, attorneys from the city of Milwaukee and Black Spruce Enterprises once again met in court. The court is in no way trying to um, overstep its bounds here. Judge William Sosny denied a request from the city to take over the property, saying the ruling can't come until the Court of Appeals makes a decision on whether or not it needs to be demolished. The court is not going to take that action at this time. Black Spruce originally bought the old mall in 2008 in the hopes of turning it into an ethanol plant. It's now trying to sell the property to Phoenix investors, but the city is opposed. The potential buyers gave Fox 6 a look inside earlier this month. They say they're currently paying for 24-7 security. This uh, matter has gone on too long. As the, the case makes its way through the system, what happens next to the old Northridge Mall stays in limbo. I will do everything I can to bring it to some conclusion. Now, all of the players will be back in court in late June. The city says it is prepared to tear down the old Boston store portion of Northridge that it owns sometime next month. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Ashley Sears, Fox 6 News.